It's been really exciting, especially since we're all freshmen, to be able to know that they're going to be here for hopefully four more years so we can keep watching them. There is a youth movement happening on Iowa State's women's basketball team, and Audie Crooks is literally at the center of it all. Algona's own is one of three freshmen who have cracked the starting lineup. And one of five freshmen getting meaningful playing time, and Audie's proving the biggest game can come from small places. It's time for tip off at Hilton, where it is loud. And the lights on the Big 12 stage are bright. But a big reason the Cyclone faithful like their chances? Knowing that with her there, um, it's always possible that we can win. They've got Audie. She's just all around like a power player. Number 55 in your program is among the top 10 in the entire conference. In points and rebounds per game and field goal percentage too. Could you have imagined that you'd be able to make the transition to the college game as well as you have? Um... I would say probably not. I thought maybe this would be a learning year, you know, maybe I only play a few minutes and, and just really like develop my skills, kind of focus on that. But um, there was just a certain point where I thought, hey, maybe I can really get after it, really do this. Even her coach, who's closing in on 800 career wins, is impressed. I, I didn't know how she would handle the physicality. There's probably one or two times a game she'll look at the bench and like, you know, I got hit. but. I would say, you know, for, you know, for a young kid to be able to do that is pretty impressive. On this night, when Audie torched Oklahoma State for her Cyclone career high of 29 points, more than 9,000 fans were in attendance. That's nearly double the entire population of her hometown, about 100 miles away. This is probably one of the most adorable little girls I've ever seen this picture right here where Audie's mom Michelle Cook has her daughter's keepsakes all over they're all going to home these were Audie's yep when she's little part of their basement now dedicated to some of Audie's most cherished hardware her state tournament balls here's her top producer award that was special to her last year at the state tournament and it's all mere steps away from the hoop she probably scored the most on that got a lot of play huh yes yes we've had neighbors tell us they fell asleep to that noise of the ball bouncing i would really start to go out to the driveway and you know my mom would audi it's time for dinner can't mom gotta make more shots you know stuff like that it's also where mom helped audi prepare for that physical play coach Fennelly talked about like she's a competitor that's where i get my competitive edge from so she's throwing elbows at me i mean she's not taking it easy. I still try to hold my own against Audie in the driveway, but it just depends on who, who's telling the story of who's winning that oh. day. <laughs> just a few miles away is Bishop Garrigan, where Audie became a legend. These records will be Audie, 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 Audie. She might have made it look easy, but Garrigan head coach Brandon Schwab says one of Iowa's best ever worked to become great. I remember her first seventh grade game, I think she shot it over top of the backboard when I was watching her, you know? So, I mean, the amount of time that she put in to become the player that she is today is just tribute to her hard work and dedication to the sport. That resiliency helped Audie lead the Golden Bears to their first ever 1A state title her junior year after falling in the championship game the previous two seasons. They'd repeat a year later. I can't wait for the moment that when I have kids, I can tell them I was a two-time state basketball championship and I played with some of the best basketball players in the state of Iowa. Former teammate and current Garrigan star Abby Capacious says the catalyst on those teams is just doing in college, which she did when they shared the court. Knowing Audie, she was gonna go down there and make her statement right away and work as hard as she can. You know, her work ethic is crazy and she's got a great mindset too. Audie left Garrigan having scored the third most points in Iowa girls basketball history. And she hasn't skipped a beat in college. You live in this dream, what's the next step to it? That's a great question. I mean, we'll find out. Life can be pretty unpredictable, but I'm just gonna take every day uh, as, a, as an opportunity, be grateful for the, the opportunities that I have. So I try not to look too far ahead. I try to kind of live in the present, but We'll figure it out when we get there. The lights of the Big 12 are bright, but a big reason the Cyclone faithful like their chances, they've got Audie. And Audie's got this.